Greetings out there in YouTube land. This is Morris Man. As always, I thank you guys for coming to my channel. At this point, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to entitle this video. It's going to be something along the lines of YouTube. What's going on? You know, let's rewind about 10 years ago. When I first got on YouTube, probably about actually that was 15 years, if not a little bit more. You know, that particular day, or actually the second day after I discovered it, I was on it for like eight hours because I was so intrigued with the wealth of information. You know, uh, I had issues with my, I think my toilet, no, my sink or something. And I went on YouTube, found the plumber, and he showed me how to fix the problem. I went to Menards. I spent like $15 on the part, put it in. And I was like, man, thank you. I'm like, you have no idea how much money and time you saved me by posting this generous video. So... You know, loved it. You know, you could sit there and watch it all day without any commercials and all this other stuff. And it's like it started off like this, then it evolved into this. You know, what it to me has evolved into is now it's a shitload of commercials. And my problem with the commercials are anybody that has money could uh, promote a product. You know, they're not like, you know, YouTube is not like a big uh you know, a uh, channel or, you know, t broadcasting channel where they don't just like just they don't just put anybody or let anybody advertise on their network. You know, they check their product and, you know, check them out, you know, because, again, the majority of the videos or commercials you see that interrupt what you're watching are some guys claiming that they can make you rich because they make because they're rich, you know, um. Uh, and I sat through some of these seminars because I'm like, you know, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. I don't know what your, your, uh, your, your game is until I watch the presentation. And the majority of the presentations are like this. You know, you, uh, see, this, you see this commercial and it's, uh, I made $22,000 in the day. Here's a check. First of all, I'm saying to myself, what company cuts a check within a day? If you make that money today, you got a check in your hand tomorrow. Come on. The bill and cycle don't work that quickly. And then you ask yourself, well, if this guy's making this kind of money, why do he want to share with me? You know, and here is why. The $22,000 that he made, it wasn't from working the business. It came from 22 suckers that signed up for the uh, the pro or the video conference and signed up for the program because at the end they hit you with $15,000 uh, a $1,500 uh, fee to get you going and if you get 22 people in a month there's your $22,000 it had nothing to do with a product that they were selling or anything of that nature you know and it's so unfortunate that YouTube just allow anybody that can pay for these commercials to set up these commercials because again I'm saying to myself and I'm not a selfish person but I'm like if I'm doing well doing this business why do I want to share my plan with other people when it kind of you know uh, tap into what I'm doing you know, so I'm like, uh, and then they claim, uh, well, you know, you don't have to do nothing. We'll set up your business. We'll run it. We'll create a website. So why do you need me? You know, if you can do all this, why won't you just do it for you instead of a total stranger? You know, but that's one of the many scams because there's so many of those scams where people claim they're making this kind of money and they living on the beach and all this kind of nonsense, you know, and uh, YouTube will allow it. You know, instead of saying, well, we got to check your credentials, run, you know, a better business bureau report to see if you're legitimate, blah, 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 nothing. If you just got the cash, you can be putting commercials across all these videos people watching. And what I noticed a couple of months ago, because I get quite a few replies and I appreciate you guys. And I try to respond to every single legitimate one. Of course, you got some trolls that you got to block and remove. But this is an interactive channel. I'm here to help you guys, you know, as far as the music and learning these great songs and just providing chords. And also have a DVD or download where I teach you how to play the rhythm guitar. You know, so it's just pretty interesting that the, the changes that I've seen. And one of the biggest changes is, of course, the commercials. You know, they're very annoying because I remember when it was commercial free. I'm like, this is why I like YouTube. It's still a regular TV. I, got it. I don't have to sit through these commercials. Now, you sit through a bunch of commercials. And they used to have what was called an inbox, kind of like direct messaging on Facebook when you want to shoot a message out or inquiry to that specific person. But you didn't want it plastered out there in the public so everybody can see it. That went away. And then I noticed... 
about a couple of months ago, like I said, you know, you guys used to send me quite a few replies or comments on my channel regarding my videos, and I would respond back. And I said, man, I'm not getting that many anymore. I'm like, and I'm like, my channel's getting bigger, so why is the notifications are not as plentiful as they used to be? And then I started to realize, you know, like I would post a video today, and then I would check back on that video, especially like if I'm selling a guitar. I see comments in there. And I'm like, why didn't I get a notification of the comments? Now, I really get that many notifications and comments. I still get a ton of loaded notifications of other channels that I subscribe to when they post the video. But I'm like, why am I not getting these comments? You know, because that's not a good thing. There's an instance which I won't talk about this really going to be really bad if that goes away or, or it, it knocks it goes down like it has been going down as far as why aren't you sending me these notifications i get some but most apparently i don't get all of them anymore you know so uh i'm saying to myself you know what's going on with youtube because i learned a long time ago in corporate america this is what they do and not just corporate america and a lot of these companies you have a management going on, and then there's a turnover in matching where the, the your boss leave or he get fired, and then they bring in a new dude, and still a new dude, especially if the if the department is running smoothly already, and still him just kind of overseeing and make sure it continues. They pressure him into making changes to justify him being here now. So now he make these dumbass uh, changes that didn't need to be changed, and sometimes overrides some of the policies or things that were working, and change it to something different that stopped working. You know, and it's like YouTube is doing it now because they used to have that inbox. The inbox went away. Then uh, now the comments are not coming as they used to because now you know people might think uh, they don't notice. They might think, well, he just don't respond anymore. So screw that, man. You know, I sent him out an inquiry about something. He never responded. It's not that he didn't want to respond. He never got the notification. You know, so that kind of slowing down. And what somebody told me, which kind of makes a lot of sense, they said, well, since YouTube is taking leaps and bounds and just growing and growing, they can't perhaps no longer do that because they can't keep up. And just like uh, two years ago, you look at your subscription numbers and each day they would change. You know, say for instance, you had 3,002 subscribers. If you got two more subscribers at the end of the day, it reflects that in the box. You see the additional two up there. Now they round it off to like 500. So, you know, you don't really, you can't really see on a daily basis if you're getting more uh, subscriptions because they round it off and you won't see a number increase until maybe a month and a half or two. You know, so it's like uh, you're not progressing, you're digressing, or digressing. And here's another thing as far as a good example of making changes that don't need to be changed. As you're watching a video, you know, down here where you uh, either pause the video or move it forward or move it backwards, you have that, uh, it looks like a little uh, speaker. It's the mute. So, you know, you hit that and you mute it for a minute. Now, up in the tab of that particular uh, page, it has the mute button up there too. So why the fuck do you need two mute buttons now? You know, why do you need to? And then you, you take away the comment notification. Like, you should have kept that and scrapped this additional, I don't need two mute points. You know, just a lot of stuff that don't make any sense that they're doing. You know, they, they got a good thing here. I mean, that's, they're kind of messing it up. Because here's one, here's one of my predictions. Because I made some predictions before and they were kind of on the money. And I understand this. It makes sense unless you're going to hire some more people, which you should do. They're growing. More people, more interaction, more stuff to do. The numbers of what you do are going up. So I'm thinking at some point in time, they're going to have a cap on how many videos you can upload. They say, okay, you can only upload 2,000. That's all we can handle here. Or once you upload a new one, the very first one that you upload, it goes away to kind of keep you know, it within that 2,000 range. And I'm just using that, that 2,000 as a, just a guesstimate. But... I can foresee that in the future because they're not most likely going to hire any more people to continue this as it grows. But, you know, it's just unfortunate that they're going in the direction that's kind of hurting the whole overall picture. You know, because, again, a lot of us go on YouTube to watch videos and documentaries without any interruptions, without every two seconds video or commercial coming up in two seconds. 
And when it comes up, it's some dude telling you that he can help you make $22,000 in a day and all that cra crazy stuff. You know, so it's just unfortunate. But I thought I would post that video because I want you guys to know that when you do leave me a comment, if I don't respond, it's because I didn't get it. You know, I just sometimes happen to go to certain videos and I see new comments that I haven't seen that were posted weeks ago. And I'm like, why didn't I get a notification? Because you usually get a notification times two. If you have a Gmail account, which Gmail owns YouTube or Google owns YouTube and Gmail, because G stands for Google Mail, uh, you go into your social uh, tab and you see the responses or comments that people left. So then you can click on that video, click on that email it opens up into you know the comment and then you click on it and it takes you to the video that's one way the other way is when you just actually on YouTube itself and you click on notification and it'll show you the drop down menu will show you all these notifications of people leaving comments and you respond now I don't see any of that all that is gone except for again people that you subscribe to the channel it gives you a notification that they just uploaded a new video but you know that's gonna really hurt the YouTube channels you know, because if you don't get inquiries, you don't respond. And, you know, there are things that on my channel that, you know, I sell to you guys as far as some of the video, uh, some of the lessons of how to play certain songs or, you know, selling guitars and things of that nature. Now, I have no idea that these, these comments I hear unless it's been a recent video that I just kind of check back to see if anybody inquired about a guitar that I'm purchasing or th that you want to purchase. But uh, I don't see the changes being good at all. Not for us, not for YouTube. You know, I just really don't. You know, they start off with all this stuff and then they slowly taking this stuff away. You know, you don't have no more again, no inboxes. You know, you're not getting all your comments. Uh, you're being bombarded with a bunch of commercials and half of these people are scam artists. You know, this is not a good thing. But I just thought I would voice this opinion because I check my notification settings. I'm like, okay, I, I do have it set up to get notifications from comments left on videos and notification for uh, channels that I subscribe to so when they upload a new video again uh, they let me know that there's a new video that they are uploading you know but um, I don't know where this is going but so far where it's going I don't like you know it's not me complaining it's just that it's they taking things away and it makes it making it more difficult for channel holders or you know channel holders to keep things going you know and interact with you guys because again this is an interactive channel because there are some channels that are real big you know you leave a comment nobody nobody responds and you look at all the comments that people left and there's no reply to none of them none of them you know for me personally it's just the opposite you know again if it ain't no troll bs or no nonsense which quickly get me rumored and blocked i respond to each and one of you guys you know Cause that's what I'm here for. I'm here to help you guys, and not, not here for for me to just show you how I can play. That that's far far from my mind. You know, that's that's not what I'm trying to do here. I'm not trying to show you you got chops and I can do all this. No, I'm trying to help you guys. You know, cause that's what you're supposed to do. You know, help out the next guy. You know, that's what we do in our musical community. We're like brothers and sisters. If you don't know it, I'll teach you. If I don't know it, please show me. You know, but uh. If there's anybody that can explain to me why is this happening, you know, or how to fix it, you know, I really appreciate it. I'm just going to say this again quickly and then I'm signing off. I said, let me call YouTube. I I'm imagining they have a, chat, uh, a number and perhaps you could talk to somebody. So I went on the Internet, found the number. And uh, again, you, uh, they're owned by Google. So uh, it was like, you know, this is Google. Uh, if you're inquiring about you know, our products as far as, you know, Google, you know, press this. If this is a YouTube related question, they sent me to the Internet, you know, YouTube.com slash support, which I went in and put in there and it brought me up to like a, a message board of people, oddly enough, complaining about the same thing about they're not getting their comment notifications and there was no answer. It's not like somebody from Google viewed this and then put in an answer. Well, here's the answer to all you guys' question. It's about six people that left the same question, and they didn't know it either. They just know that they're no longer getting the majority of their comments. So I'm like, that was not helpful at all. And what Google and YouTube is telling me, in a sense, 
We don't want to be bothered with you. You know, here's a number, but it, it goes to here. And when you when we send you here, you don't get no resolution to any questions or inquiries. And it's so unfortunate because YouTube is a good thing, but you know, the direction I see is going in, it's gonna be it's getting worse. It's not getting any better. You know, so until next time, take care and thanks for watching.